Good morning, YouTube. Magandang. Umaga for my Filipino friends. I hope you're doing really well out there. Kamusta kayong lahat. Chloe and I are doing extremely well. We're currently in Portugal on holiday. It's actually like maybe day seven or eight of our holiday. So we've been here for a while now. We arrived in Lisbon where we had an amazing time. We stayed there for a couple of days. We explored, checked out the cathedral, went up to the castle, had some delicious Portuguese food and wine. And in fact, one evening we were in this like really historic looking restaurant it was just the two of us we got to enjoy this fabulous musician playing the guitar and singing after Lisbon we ended up in a place called Azoya and stayed in this really nice hotel called Charm Nature where we were pretty active we went kayaking <laughs> and we went rock climbing where Chloe absolutely smashed it for someone who's semi afraid of heights she really smashed the rock climbing yes and we also did tons of hiking in azoya where the terrain is pretty unforgiving ah. even at one point during a hike we were practically bouldering and having to use these ropes to climb up this really steep vertical we're in our final destination now we're staying at a place called m casa guest house it's really beautiful run by these two guys who do a fabulous job they're super hospitable it's a lovely place and we're going to be staying here with the plan to try and relax as much as possible and i thought why not do like a day where i bring you guys along and just share the entire day with you and what chloe and i get up to It looks really good. We've got coffee on the way. Cheers to you. Hello. Hello. I think one of the biggest challenges that we face today is just the weather. There's a bit of sun, but you can see a massive grey cloud next to it. Yeah. It's just raining a little bit. The rain is kind of inter... Dispersed. Interspersed, thank you. We're going to go check out the beach, go on a bit of a hike, try to avoid the rain, if not, enjoy the rain, and to have some food. We're walking down to the beach right now, Chloe and I. It's a very exciting time because we haven't walked for about 48 hours. We stayed in the hotel yesterday all day and we drove the day before to the hotel, but our feet were, were tired from all the hiking. So we're making our way down to the beach. It looks beautiful. If you listen very carefully, you might just be able to hear the waves. Or the car. Or the car. <laughs> So we left the beach, it was just a little bit. Yeah, now we're taking this trail that's gonna go along the coast up and then eventually down into the forest, which is just behind where we're staying. So the terrain for hiking in Portugal is really fun. The environment differs massively from point to point. You can be in like where we are now, very bleak, sandy, dusty, not a lot of wildlife, and then go into grassy area with loads of wildlife and loads of birds. Chloe? So I'm a bit sad that we didn't get to go to the beach today. 
So am I. I'd hoped, hello, I'd hoped to take you with us to the beach, but I have an idea. So the idea that I have is obviously we're not gonna go to the beach today because, well, we went to the beach, but it turned out that it wasn't very good. So instead, we'll go to the beach tomorrow and we'll show you that. Good idea? Sure. Let's go to the beach. have a look i'm so worried about the wheels yeah so the restaurant we're going to this evening is called terra a terra so this is a portuguese restaurant so we can expect fabulous grilled fish what else can we expect chloe just tapas and stuff do you already know what you're gonna have no not yet no she doesn't know i have read some recommendations but we'll see when we get there One question. Yeah. How are you so beautiful? Stop it. I've got some swordfish. Okay. Yeah. I'm getting octopus, I'm getting sweet, I'm getting salty, I'm getting sesame. It's great. Right, so this is the, um, the swordfish. <laughs> With Asian sauce. Okay, there's more Portuguese than Asian because we're in Portugal. But it's got like an Asian tang, small amount of Asian with a lot of Portuguese, and that's delicious. So let me just try some slaw. I'm a big fan of the purple goodness. Mm, you got a bit of slaw on your finger. Let me get that. This is a weird thing to do, but I actually like to eat the entire prawn. Most people ignore the head or the shell, but... Not you. Not me. I like the shell, it's crunchy. And it's easier than feeling it. You don't waste anything. The head? <laughs> Stop. Oh. 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 I want to try and experience this burger with you. Very crusty bun. <laughs> I need to go again. I feel like that was an underwhelming bite. Look, I just got bun. It was all bun. Bro. The patty is juicy. It looks I'd say it's pink, a, but not too A little pink. bit pink, yeah. Very nice. The cheese, good, cheesy. This is obviously a very Portuguese meal. Mm -hmm. The burger. The potatoes are from Portugal. Probably. Yeah. I'm gonna eat they taste very good. Excellent. 
Any last words for the people? I'm sorry, I can't even think of a pun. We'll catch up with you later. <laughs> the burger itself has a delicious layer of beef and bacon and ali oli and a bit of ches. Is it the best burger you've had so far? On this holiday, absolutely the best burger I've had so far. This place may possibly be the best dessert we've ever had because they have a brownie. But more on that later. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. A bit of cream, some nuts. So, the queen of desserts, what are your thoughts? It's a good brownie. It looks like there are some almond flakes. This is a nutty brownie. And that looks like there's caramel in the middle. Ooh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I think, that, I think that's right. Okay, here we go. It's got, it's got like a, a crunchiness to it. Any last words? It's getting a bit chocolate. So I'll catch you <laughs> next time. <laughs> so how was that brownie, Chloe? You look like you really enjoyed it. Yeah, it was good. Um, it was gooey and yummy, it creamy, was, it chocolatey. Was, it was. Nutty. All the things that a brownie should be. I appreciate the burger wasn't necessarily Portuguese, however. <laughs> Neither was my pulled pork <laughs> bun. <laughs> what was Portuguese was the beer, which was brewed just up the road. The wine, which was made just in the mountains. Do they have mountains in Portugal? They do, well, sort of the big hills. <laughs> They're more hills than mountains, it was, to be fair. Ooh, and the ooh. tapas, to be fair, we could have ordered more tapas. They yes. had more dishes, yes. but all the ones that we wanted were sort of crossed out. Yes, unfortunately. So we ordered the burgers instead, which were excellent. Wonderful. So, um, I don't know where we're going because the car's over, over there. there. I think that's it from us. Good night. What is good night in Portuguese? Bon nuit. Bon nuit. I think. And bon nuit. Nu bon nuit. Bon noa. Bon no. Bon something. <laughs> None of this is correct. We don't actually know. Everybody speaks wonderful English and we haven't had to learn anything more than obrigada. <laughs> well, I learned Italian thinking we we're going to go to Italy, but they're not letting us in. You've so. learned Italian and I've learned Tagalog. <laughs> <laughs> ne neither has helped us in Portugal. But yes, on that note, good night. Au revoir. A biento. <laughs> bye bye. 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 Thank <laughs> you.